What's up guys, this is Sean Heather and in this video we are going to do a benchmarking test comparison between Huawei P30 Pro and Oppo Reno 10X Zoom smartphones. Both of these smartphones, they are flagship smartphones from their respective brand and both of them come with the flagship hardware. So we are going to have a quick comparison of the benchmarking test score result of these two smartphones. So the benchmarking applications we got today here, they are Android Benchmarking, 3 d Mark, Geekbench 4, Basemark OS 2 and Basemark X. We have already performed all of these tests and we are going to have a quick look on the test score result only. So here we go. So first of all, let's start with Android Benchmark. Oppo Reno 10X Zoom scored 359,612 and Huawei P30 Pro scored 284,379. So as you can see that in this test the winner is Oppo Reno 10X Zoom variant. If you go to the individual test score result here you can have a look on the CPU, GPU, UX and memory test result. And you can see that in CPU, GPU and UX performance of Oppo Reno 10X Zoom is better and when it comes to memory performance of Huawei P30 Pro is better but our concern is the overall result and in that the winner is Oppo Reno 10X Zoom especially the major difference is coming from the GPU side so you can get the idea that Mali G72 GPU is not so great compared to Adreno 640 we got on the Oppo Reno 10X Zoom now let's go back from here and let's have a look on 3D Mark. It's a gaming benchmarking test and this test is divided in multiple parts. For example, Slingshot Extreme and Slingshot. And Slingshot is divided in two parts as well, OpenGL and Vulkan. So first of all, let's have a look on the Slingshot. In that, Huawei P30 Pro scored 3071 and Oppo Reno 10X Zoom scored 7555. So you can see that the difference is huge. Oppo Reno 10X Zoom is scoring more than twice of what Huawei P30 Pro scored. And talking about the Slingshot Extreme, for OpenGL, Huawei P30 Pro scored 3552 and Oppo Reno 10X Zoom scored 5662. And in Vulkan, Huawei P30 Pro scored 4444 and Oppo Reno 10X Zoom scored 4960. So as you can see that in all of these three tests, the winner is Oppo Reno 10X Zoom. Now let's go back from here and let's have a look on Geekbench 4. This test is also divided in multiple parts, CPU and compute and once again CPU is divided in single core and multi core. So Oppo Reno 10X Zoom scored 3121 in single core and 11,293 in multi-core while Huawei P30 Pro scored 3,260 in single core and 9,896 in multi-core. So in single core the winner is Huawei P30 Pro and in multi-core the winner is Oppo Reno 10X2. Let's go back from here and let's have a look on the compute test result now. So Huawei P30 Pro scored 6606 and Oppo Reno 10X Zoom scored 7495. So in this test as well the winner is Oppo Reno 10X Zoom. So out of three tests in Geekbench 4, Oppo Reno 10X Zoom is winner in two of them. And now let's have a look on Basemark OS 2. So Huawei P30 Pro scored 4286 and Oppo Reno 10X Zoom scored 4688 and once again you can have a look on the system, memory, graphics and web browsing as you can see that in system, memory and graphics performance of Oppo Reno 10X Zoom is better and in web browsing performance of Huawei P30 Pro is better but overall it's the Oppo Reno 10X Zoom that has scored more points and that's why we will consider it as a winner here as well. And now let's have a look on the last test for today and that's Basemark X. This is also a gaming benchmarking test. 
and it gives the idea about the GPU capability. So Oppo Reno 10X Zoom has scored 46,210 and Huawei P30 Pro has scored 45,474. So the difference is not so much this time but still the winner is Oppo Reno 10X Zoom and Basemark X as well. So in all of this test, most of the time performance of Oppo Reno 10X Zoom is better. It's scoring more points compared to Huawei P30 Pro. But Huawei P30 Pro is also a flagship smartphone and as we have seen previously, the performance of the device is great when it comes to gaming, multitasking and day-to-day -day usage. But talking about the Oppo Reno 10X Zoom, as you can see, that it comes with a bit better hardware specs and that's why it is scoring more points compared to Huawei P30 Pro in the benchmark test. But in real life, both of these devices, they are going to perform brilliantly and we will not feel any kind of issue in terms of performance. So that's all for now friends. Thanks for watching this video. If you like this, give it a thumbs up, share it with your friends, subscribe the channel and press the bell icon to get the notification for future uploads and I'll see you guys next time in another video. Have a nice day.